Lord, thank you, Lord. 250 meters, guys. It was that deep using the Exodus 350 grams. I'm with Lincoln. Lincoln, smile. <laughs> My boatman! Best boatman! Yes! Whew, thank you, Lord! The head of the prompted fish is very delicious if cooked with soap and vegetables. These are the ingredients what you need to use in cooking the prompted fish. You need the lemongrass. Uh, this is we, we call this aswete in Philippines. It smells so good bell pepper you know what this is onions some spada pepper and ginger when you cook the prompted fish the last thing that you're going to place is this one the first thing you're going to put is this ginger ginger and the bell pepper this tree this tree is the first thing that you place when it's uh, when before it boils after that when it's almost cooked no, you also need to place this this one bell pepper this one ginger bell pepper and this one when it's when you start cooking it this is the first four ingredients you need to place lemongrass ginger bell pepper and this kind of pepper when it's almost cooked you place this aswete this smells so good and this onions when it's already almost cooked then you will have a very nice soup this is the prompted fish that we just caught in fishing if you can see it's starting to boil the first thing you need to place is ginger bell pepper and the uh, we call the other pepper spada you need to include the seeds of the bell pepper the lemongrass do not place salt first while boiling the prompted fish you place the salt 10 to 5 minutes before removing it from the fire. No heat, boiling time at least 30 to 35 minutes. After 30 minutes, you place the onion leaves and the aswete. I still have not placed any salt. I wait for the last of the vegetables to cook. That's the time to place the salt and taste it. This part is the tomatoes and salt is placed. This really tastes delicious. This is the most delicious part of the prompted fish, the head. This is called tinola. Sure. 
Ugma ah. Okay.